Man with Asperger's syndrome spends over 15 years transforming his home into a cat playhouse. Hey, lovely people. I'm Scott Leffler from Wonder Earth. Before we begin, make sure you smash the like button, subscribe to our channel, and click the notification bell for new amazing videos. We love our pets, and there are some pet owners that always go above and beyond when it comes to taking care of their animals. Homeowner Greg Kruger is no exception. At 49 years old, he was diagnosed with Asperger syndrome, which gave him a better understanding towards the way he typically acted. He was a little antisocial and really preferred staying home with his cats rather than going out and socializing with humans. After his diagnosis, it all made sense. Greg Kruger is a man living in Minnesota that would rather spend time with his four cats than with humans. He thought he was antisocial, but when he received an official diagnosis of Asperger's syndrome at the age of 49, his obsession with his cats made a lot more sense. Greg has built overhead catwalks for his four cats throughout his house. They total over 100 yards, and he's still not done. He says, I think about it constantly. I can't fall asleep. I'm still thinking about it. Think about the design. I wake up. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it all day at work. Greg is an avid fan of trails and paths, so he decided to combine his passions to create a cat dream house. Greg said, Obviously, my house would not be like this if I didn't have Asperger's. If it takes a long time, I don't care, because if I like what I'm doing, I almost don't want to finish what I'm doing. In this specific cutout, one side is shaped like a cat, while the other side looks like a bluebird. Greg says when his cats look through the cat-shaped hole, they're staring right at a bluebird. This is definitely a masterpiece that Greg is proud of. He says, I don't feel like I live alone, even though I'm the only person living here. We're like a family. There's even a book titled All Cats Have Asperger Syndrome, and Greg says that one reason he identifies and bonds with cats so well. While some people may think it's odd, he's just doing it because cats have always seemed to understand him, even when he was a little boy. Others thought he was a little different, sometimes distant, but cats and him have always had a close bond. His cats can hide in one of the many hideouts without having to be worried about the dark. He's included the proper lighting and padding as he continues to cut holes through the walls and ceiling, providing his cats with a simple paradise. Greg has worked on this project for more than 15 years and said it's more like a puzzle that's never quite finished. Greg also has a small graveyard for his cats that have passed away over the years, complete with headstones. Every day he goes out and touches each headstone because he believes it gives him good luck. Knowing people with both Asperger's syndrome and autism, it's great to see that Greg has really found his niche. It provides him with a lot of happiness, along with a purpose that he's always striving to fulfill. I'm sure the cats don't mind one bit. I know my cat would be in heaven with a house like this.